Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you a new fish from our latest shipment. Got lots of big beautiful peacocks, haps in, so make sure to stick around to the end of the video to see all the new fish. And then all the fish you see in the video will be on the website, www.ronsickles.com. There'll be a link down in the description below and the comments. Uh, and then if you have any questions or need any help, feel free to reach out to us. So, let's get started. Got some star sapphires in, five inch. Only got two of them this time, so if you want one, make sure to uh, hop on the website. Bang of sunshine. That's a yellow on these guys, four and a half inch. Eureka reds, five inch and four and a half inch males. Lemon Jake. I think all five inch extra extra large plus males. Red, blue, OB peacocks. These are a little smaller than I usually get. Uh, these are um, around four and a half extra large males. I got some nicer ones in the next tank I'll show you. Blue bear be fryer eye. This is actually uh, a fire and ice blue bear be fryer eye. You can see all the, uh, the red in them. Uh, blue neon. I think I got a nicer one I can show you. But I got two extra large ones. My bossy. I got nicer ones of those too I can show you. I got one blue dragon blood in. Extra large. Great color. There's a big old lemon jake. Iceberg blue bear be fire eye. You can see he's got that nice blaze on top there. This, here's the bigger blue neon, a little more color, but they're both both extra large males. Here's a little nicer red blue of a peacock. I think this is a four and a half inch male, maybe maybe closer to five, but. They're a little cheaper than the, the jumbo ones I've been having on, so ha have it on the website. I got some more Mabasi in there. I think that's about it for this tank. I think, yeah, I got the two star sapphires, five inch in here, the males. I'll probably end up having some females on the website in a week or so, some bigger five inch females. And then I also got some Lemon Jake and Benga Sunshine females in. I think I only got six. But they're like four, four and a half inches. Breeder sized females. Got one Platinum OB Fire Rye male in. Five inch. Nice, nice white coming in on him. There's a really nice Benga Sunshine. Five inch. Even more yellow in person. Nova Blue Long Nose Hap. Got a few of these guys, all jumbo, so five and a half inches. Great color. Still not seen very often in the hobby, so if you're looking for a little rare fish, they're a great option. They do great with peacocks and haps. They only get about eight, nine inches full grown, full grown, usually close to eight. Um, so they do great in like 75 to 125s. Uh, bigger Red Blue will be peacock. This is definitely a 5 inch extra large plus male. Great color. Here's a uh, stud iceberg blue bear be fry rye. 5 incher. He's got a lot of white in him. Um, not as much of that blueberry as the other ones, but really nice male. Big blaze. Standard uh, electric blue fry rye. Basically all blue. And then I got my uh, signature fry rye throw offs. You've seen these before, each one's a little unique. This one's actually got a little blaze to them, but they're throw-offs from the Obi Fry Rye breeder groups. They just don't get the blotches, so they get a little bit of the other colors in them, makes them unique. But they're on the website, that's a five-inch male. 
Got more lemons in here. Some other fry rye throw offs. Oh, Nagara flame tails. Here we go. I've got a few five inchers. I've got males with even nicer color, but they look better and better in person. I got a couple grout tanks of my own with those with beautiful males. There's some bigger boys. I'll start off with some VC10. Jumbo males. Excellent, excellent color. This is definitely a must have, half in my opinion. Staple for any peacock hat all male tank. Really beautiful fish. They actually get uh, more purple, um, purplish color. Not as blue as some people think. But, and then some red in there as well. But I've got a few of them, all jumbos, all with great color. I have one Rostratus male. Seven to eight inches. Big boy. Captive bread and raised. Not a ton of color yet, but a good amount of color as you can see for his size. Um, just starting to come into his own, getting dominant. Um, but yeah, he's available. Seven to eight inches. You rarely see him. That big captive bread and raised in the States. I got one buco yellow male. Six to seven inches. Again, captive bread and raised. Buco radicii, buco yellow. Just starting to color up. These guys are very late bloomers, if you don't know already. He's gonna like double in size. They, they get like 14 inches full grown. Uh, they get big. Uh, but yeah, just starting to color up. Definitely a guaranteed male. Six to seven inches. I only got one this time. So if you want one, better be quick. They don't last long usually. More Nova Blues in here. I have one Malawi Gar in here, but he is already sold. He's pre-ordered, but I will have... I have another one on the website currently, and I'll, I'll have more um, that are quarantining right now that will be ready in about a week after you see this video. Let's see what else I got in here. Give me one minute. And these guys got to finish, um, the fins were a little tattered, I got to hold on to them a little longer for an extra week, um, just to help heal their fins. But I got some big starry nights in, um, beautiful, beautiful fish, and they're mixed in with the, uh, Haps and Peacocks, they do great in Peacock hat tanks, but these guys should be about six inches, but they got to finish, um, they, they are to quarantine, I just want to let them, their heal, their fins heal up some, um, they were just a little tattered from coming in. Um, being in the bag, so they'll be good in about a week. Um, so a week after you see this video I'll have some six inch starry nights on the website, and I've never had them that big on the website before so They make a great addition to peacock hat tanks All right, we're gonna move over here Start off with some bigger ones I got some big boy comps in standard compressed steps eye biters Seven to eight inches. If you don't know already, these guys are extremely late bloomers, so they're not gonna have a whole lot of color yet. But all guaranteed now, vented, easy to vent them at this size. I got a few more I'll show you. I got one Fenestratus Chofu Jumbo Plus. It's actually got one bad eye, you can see. If somebody wants them, I can do like, I can do like 20 bucks for them if somebody wants them. So just reach out to me. He has fins a little wonky there. May have been nipped off and rehealed, but yeah, I feel like 20 bucks for them. He's, they're usually like 6 to 7 inches. They're usually like 80 $85 dollars that size.
Combo Rocks, I got two of these guys in. One 67 incher. That's this one right here. Great color, nice yellow. And the other one is in this tank. You'll see them in a minute. And if you're seeing these, these are Obi comps, but they are um, already sold. They were pre ordered. There's another comp. He's got a little blue sheen to him. You, you can see it on the camera. Yeah. Like I said, they're, they're very late bloomers, unfortunately. Yeah, like this is a little bigger male. He's already sold, but you can see he's starting to get some blue to him. But that, that's an 8 to 9 inch big boy. And then I also have some, let me see. I haven't looked at these guys yet. Just, I got them in. Yeah, I got some Venustas hybrids, so you can see. Get the camera to focus for a minute. There we go. See, they got a little different color than a standard Venustas would. A little more um, orange. Different color yellow than standard Venustas, which have that green yellow. Um, but this, like this one, um, is like six to seven inches. I gotta make a product type for them on the website. But by the time you see this video, uh, tomorrow, Saturday, uh, they should they should be on the website, and I'll, I'll probably do these at a, a good price, less than normal Venustas would be. But they're big, beautiful fish. I got two of them in here, and some others from a um, last month's um, shipment. They have just as much color. Right. Checking to see if there's water on the camera. Some jumbo males in here. I got some big old Madoka white lips, biggest ones I've had for quite a while. I think these were all jumbo plus, six to seven inches. Let's see. Ooh, hold still, buddy. Beautiful males. Got the nice white lips on them. I got three of them, I think. Yeah, I think three of them. Should all be that Jumbo Plus size. Here's that smaller Pombo. Jumbo. One Buko Noto. Extra Large Plus. I've got a few smaller ones, but I, mean, I think two smaller ones, but that's the only, it's the largest one I got this time. Check, I think he was in the XO Plus size bracket. Right, he's at the just in the jumbo now. So jumbo male, about five and a half inches. One living stone eye. Jumbo male. Got some egg spots to him. A little bit of blue coming in. He's still young. I do have a six to seven inch male jumbo plus. Um, on the other side of the facility. Uh, he'll be on the website too. He should still be available. But he's got some nice blue to him. I think I got two Fusco um, that are Jumbo Plus in. And then I've got plenty of Jumbo Males, Extra Large Plus for my grot tanks. One Albino Comp, Jumbo. Got that nice purple blue sheen to them, almost pinkish. I've got two bigger OB Peacocks in. I usually don't do um, what you see is what you get by now fish really anymore, but if anybody's watching the video and they like a certain one, just let me know and I can give you a price for an exact fish. But here's the first one, basically a blueberry. It's a little yellow, a little bit of multicolor in him. He should be he should be jumbo. Yeah, he's about five and a half inches. So that's one. I showed you both sides. And then I got this like platinum canary look one. 
a little bit of orange, a good amount of yellow. Both OB peacocks. Both, yeah, in the jumbo size bracket. But if you like a certain one, just send me a screenshot of which one you, you want, and I'll give you a price for them. But I usually never get OB peacocks in that big. I got one Royal Nostratus. Oh, come on. He just escaped. Yeah, I need to catch him, and then I got a Chiofu in here. I'm going to show you. Doing this one hand, so bear with me. Here's the Chiofu. Jumbo Mail. Alright, here we go. Royal Rostratus. These guys color up a little sooner than regular Rostratus because they are hybrid. Um, but look, beautiful Mail. I think this was. Jumbo, so like five and a half inch. Yep, just over five and a quarter. So for that tank, all right, these guys are mostly around five inch or so. Right from Borlai. These guys are really nice. About five and five inch. Yeah, I got two extra large ones, and then I make two extra large plus. No, and then jumbo plus. No, no. <laughs> My bad. Extra large and then extra large plus. I'm getting confused. So four and a half and five and a, five inch. First cicada. Some young males just starting to. Uh, I'm not really getting the tire yet, but they're still young. They're about six inch, seven inch. And I got two males. They're very late bloomers. They take a while to color up. Smaller Chiofu Fenestratus. Spalinotus Tanzania Insignus. It's an extra large male. And then I have a few large plus in another tank. Azorus, two males, around five inch, one big Taiwan. Another OB Peacock. Here's a really nice red from Borelai male, five inch. I got a few smaller OB comps. Uh, they're not gonna have much color yet because they're this size. They take a while to color up. But uh, this one's like extra large, extra large plus. And then I got a few more in this tank. I'll show you in a minute. Got a few Toe. Not much color yet, but guaranteed males. They're like jumbo. We got a few other Toe's in there. May have some more color, but it's 
about it for that tank. Another nice OB Peacock. Peacock, Mara Mallet Point. There's a five inch Mara Mallet. They're a pretty rare fish. Azores, extra large. This guy's got some crazy blue to him. There's an extra large Broly Eye. One more eye, blue dolphin. This little Obi Comp, he's got quite a bit of color. Hmm. It's a little stud for his size. He's a. Uh, he's only like four inch, four and a half inch. And I got one Starry Night, smaller one available. Large plus. And like I mentioned before, I have some bigger ones available here in a week or so. Let's go. There we go. And then I got a few giant haps in. These are a rare fish as well. Kind of similar to the Nova Blue Long Nose. They get that deep blue to them. They just get some red in their fins. But I think I got two extra large males. And then here's the last tank. Some smaller guys. Got a few little star sapphires, three and a half inch, large. No chips yet, but they're just still young. And Cygnus, four inch males. Little Otter Point Jake, four inch, large plus. And I think I got one extra large in here. I didn't show you in the video, and before I forgot. The little Obi Peacock. Some more Obi Tomps, little males, quite a bit of color. Wow, these are really nice. It's another like four inch, four and a half inch male. Little Buko Noto. Z Rock, Yo Blaze, little blaze trying to come in. I got a few of those. More Obi Peacocks. And I think that's about it. And then I uh, forgot to mention for the uh, Platinum Obi Fry Rye in here, I showed you I had that one male. That's down there, right next to the sponge filter. I've got some females as well. They're like four and a half inch or so. Uh, I think I got eight of them. So they'll be on the website as well. If, um, if you breed those to a platinum male, you, you should get basically all platinum fry. Um, you can breed them with the other Obi Fry Rye, the blueberries, icebergs, fire and ice, and you can get a mix of colors. Uh, but uh, yeah, that's about it. I just got yeah, I forgot these. I've got two OBZ rocks, this guy, and then Algae Grew back in there. You can't see him, but they both look like this. OBZ rock, yellow blaze. And then I got one BOD, about five inch, maybe five to five and a half inch. Turn off the, there we go. Yeah, BOD, black horn, dorsal lithobates. Beautiful male. I rarely have them this big anymore. I got some smaller four inch males that are cheaper on the website as well. You'll see them. But uh, yeah, that is all the fish from the new shipment. 
Uh, I'll be adding some other fish from another shipment in about a week or so. They're just finishing the quarantine. Um, she has some Malawi gar, some other hybrids, some, some more star sapphires, um, maybe some buco spectabilis, some other peacocks, um, maybe some other mbuna species. But, uh, and then, uh, as always, I got plenty of other fish in the rest of our facility and my other building. So I've got way more than what you just saw in the video. This is just the new stuff that came in. If you saw anything you liked, make sure to head over to the website, and I'm sure you'll see lots of other fish you like as well. But uh, thanks for watching.